Today I'm going to show you how to make the egg binding emulsion for painting with egg tempera uh, and using egg tempera pigments. So we've got a pigment here, it's in powdered form, it's crushed rock basically. Um, this colour is yellow ochre which is a very commonly used colour in iconography. Um, now obviously it's in a, a crushed pigment format so we need to mix some um, binding emulsion so that we can mix up the paint and paint with it. Okay, so you will need one egg, a dessert spoon, a small bowl for mixing, a bigger bowl to separate the egg white into, you need some wine vinegar, or you can use cider if you haven't, haven't got any wine vinegar, um, some water, and uh, also need some kitchen roll. I'll show you why in a minute. Okay, so what we do, we take the egg, break it open, and we've got to separate the white from the yolk, just like baking a cake, try not to break the yolk in the process, and now what we've got to do, there's still white covering the yolk, so we need to put it in our hands like that. Roll it from one hand to another. A couple of times. Start getting the egg white to your hands. Wipe it off. Same again there. And then when you're happy that there's enough of the white been taken off, you can move it towards the edge of your fingers and then just pierce the edge of the yolk you don't want any of the skin of the yolk to go in into the bowl you just want as much of, of the yolk as you can get you don't want any egg white in there you don't want any of the skin okay so that's enough so we'll throw that away now Next we add a dessert spoon, just one dessert spoon of water, and then three quarters of a dessert spoon of white wine vinegar. Stir that up there so we get a kind of really consistency and it's all mixed. Okay. And that can be used to paint with now. So for example. Take some pigment, drop it on the plate. Now, um, it's uh, traditional to use a hog hair brush for this, but any sort of coarse brush will do. I've just got like a, uh, an acrylic brush. So, depending on how thick the paint wants to be, is determined by how much of this you use. So, the more you use, the thinner it'll be. So, go. So that's really quite thick there. So. Add a little bit more if you want to make like a wash. So if we put that in. 